big batty girls, boys, and everything in between. Welcome back to another episode of Antics with Ash. My is so live and direct today, so if these pop out, I'm so sorry. Please welcome my fave gal. She's the artist of the moment, Katie Baser. Yay! Hi, baby. Hi. Give me a hand. I'm Oh, we're so far away. I hate this fucking couch that it feels like we're a million miles apart. I know. Okay, talk to me. How's life been? Life is great. Yeah. I'm just slaying. Slaying. I just moved to London. So I thought you were, you know, I actually did think you were in London, so that's confused me a bit. No, I lived in Brighton. And I was yeah, you're like, Brighton, I was, babe. It was like ruining my life. Oh, so you were just consistently yeah. travelling? But like now that. I'm, but I'm here. And, and you're live it. and direct. And it's great. Really? I, Do you prefer it? I prefer it so much. Really? I cook eggs in the morning. <laughs> I have Because you can't do that in Brighton. I can't. I <laughs> you mean, can't. I would rather sleep. And then I'd, really? I'd leave like 10 minutes before I'd have to leave and then I'd get on the train like. Oh, so now you have... Now I wake up, I shower, I cook eggs, I eat, nice. eat things. and I, I I'm eat a, things. I'm a human now. I I'm eat an adult. Things. You have yeah. to do so much adult things. Yeah, you really do. It's hell. Like I bought coasters the other day. Ew. But they're cool coasters. They're like um, vinyl shaped coasters, like music. Oh, that's really so. Cause like, I'm a singer. I'm an, yeah, because I'm an artist. If you can't guess what I do, look at my mantle piece. <laughs> it's very that. We love. Um, did you love being in Brighton? I did. It what was, was very your vibes fun. on it? I mean, I love the beach. I love the ocean. I love the sea. Yeah, I like. Also, the, the general vibe. Of Everyone's Brighton. chill. Yeah, like it's, it's like one of the places where you could walk down the street and see like a drag queen and like. In broad daylight, like, like it doesn't need to be no, so. No, no one looks. No one looks. Yeah, everyone just goes like, "Hey, that's it. I love it. I love it." My dad grew up in Brighton. Really? Yeah. So we used to be go all the time, even when he'd moved to London. Cute. Like we used to be in Brighton every weekend. Brighton's great, and in the summertime, why am, look at how I'm sat right now. Why am I sat like that? Why do I look like that? <laughs> Did you see that? Is that how it's I look? It's giving um. Who is that character? Oh my god, the matey from, from 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 the who's that? Yes, that with the big that. shoulders and the big head. It's because you've got a jacket on. Okay, though. hang on, let the, me readjust myself. The, I must say That's this couch isn't good for posture. It's not, and I'm fucking look at the size of me. It I'm a gigantic your... human. You're not gigantic. No, I mean I'm extended. I'm very long. How tall are you? I'm like five nine, five ten. Are you? I am. I'm a tall girl. You're not. I am. Do you know what's so funny? <laughs> Look at the size right? of me. Right, because Sorry. I'm literally two foot nothing. <laughs> I, to me, but I you give off you give off six foot energy. Thank you. You do. I say this to Molly all the time. To me, everyone's the same height. No, I, I hear could you. not have told you what height you were. I'm... To me, everyone sits at like a five seven because because everyone <laughs> I'm, I'm like this to everyone. <laughs> so it, it's all the same to me. I can't believe I was sat like that for ages. Maybe I should just keep it. It's comfy. Fuck it. Yeah, be comfy, man. Is what it is. Yeah, mi casa es su casa. Mi casa es su casa. So talk to me about music. How is it going? It's going great. I just released a single. I've got a mixtape coming out. I'm going on tour. <gasps> yeah. Where, where are you going on tour? Everywhere. <gasps> like everywhere. I'm the one. You did a tour just... before, right? Yes. How was that? Because I saw you do, like, as in you did a tour. It wasn't like, oh, she's doing Europe. You did do you did Australia and shit, right? Man, how was that? It was weird, because it was, like, the other side of the world, and I, like, didn't know what to expect. Yeah. And then when I got to the venue, it was, like, four. I wasn't performing until, like, eight, and there was people already queuing. They're like, oh, my God, it's Katie Baser. Stop. Oh, my fucking God. And I was like, oh, my God. Does that not feel so weird yes. to know that you have people... So strange. ...that love you, like... Across the fucking park. And the thing park. is that the fans are, like, the same. Like, they're just insane and, like, really? crazy and will scream and shout at me and I'm not, I want that. Scream at me. Yeah. As in, do you find that your fans are generally just chaotic? Yeah, nutters. But really? But welcome then, because I'm also one of those. Well, as in, imagine if you had ones that just sat there and, like, twiddled their thumbs. I would be like that sing. Charlie XCX video, like, fucking move! I thought you yes. were a song! Fucking move! <laughs> that would be me. And Can I've you done give me before. some fucking energy? I'm walking off stage. Oh, my God, there's been times where, like, that. they just sort of stand there. Not at my shows, at, like, festivals when I I'm doing uh, things. I hate. And they're just, there's one, one show, I'm not going to say what it was, but I honestly was on the stage going, what the fuck? I was going, really? what's wrong with you? My manager was there like. <laughs> just tell me if it was the UK. It was the UK. No. Mm -hmm. it wasn't London, no way. It was London. Fuck you. It was a festival. <laughs> was it? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> and I honestly got on, I was buzzing, I was so excited and I got on and everyone was like. I can't believe you said it was London. I know. What's that about? There was a few real ones that were like, Woo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. The rest yeah, yeah. of them are literally just like, who is this girl talking about, like, boobs and stuff? <laughs> boobs and dick. Boobs and dick. But, like, for me, I don't even know, need to know the artist. It, if I'm watching if I'm music... I'm vibing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I'm vibing, I'm vibing. It doesn't yeah. matter. As in, I'd 
vibe to a solo violinist. Like, yeah. it's fine. It is what it is. I'd be like... <laughs> but, like, when people don't give me the energy, I give back more. So I was, like, all of right. my songs, I was singing, like... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. And then you just got really... Yeah. And there were all of the, like, there were these girls at the front, like... <laughs> looking at me, like, is she OK? And I was no. Like, <laughs> Yeah, to be fair, but you have to, because otherwise like, what are you going to do? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> right, I want to know, yeah. what was Australia like as a place? Because, do you know Simulation. what? I knew, I knew you were going to say that. Simulation. I knew you were going to say that. Do you know why? For some reason, it's so far away in my head. <laughs> I don't have, like, a burning desire to go. It's beautiful. Right. And I love the ocean. I'm a lover of the beach and the Me water, too. so that was perfect. Okay. But, like, as a place... Yeah. Everything is perfect. The people are hot. They eat healthy really? food. The food's amazing. The weather's amazing. Everyone's friendly. Right, but you're and like, I'm where's there, the grit like, and the grunge? Something's not right. Right. But, I mean, it was great, but I'm finding, because I'm, like, travelling now, going all over the world, every, <laughs> every city is just the same. Really? Like, everywhere is just the same. Just, and... Like, just, like, a slightly different like, version. Sydney was, like, London yeah. on roids. It was just, like, cleaner, right. bigger... But like, and nicer the weather yeah. and just not gloom and doom. Yeah, but like it was, it was a cool place, but definitely there's something going on, simulation. I agree, because when I think of Australia, all I think... <laughs> did you see that video that went viral? <laughs> of this, of that wedge kangaroo. <laughs> that's like that. Yeah. And it looks like he's been going gym for five years. Yes. And, he's, uh, and, and he had someone's dog in a headlock. Oh, my God, in the river. And was literally like, like that in the river. That's the video that I see in my head when anyone says Australia. So I think I think I'm actually blessed. And I, I, I thought I'd see like loads of spiders and shit, but I didn't see any. Yeah, I saw some whales though, and I cried. <gasps> Did you? I love the whales. Oh, I saw some whales in um, the Caribbean, and I was literally like, <gasps> yeah, unreal. You know, on Instagram, when you have like the suggested posts, it's always humpback whales. Yes, is it? humpback whales. I'm humpback whales. And I sit there for ages, just like, wow. Really? Wow. What sort wow. Of, so but, your For You page is giving humpback whales... Stingrays. And... Dolphins. Really? That's what it. Are you just like a sea world lover? Yes, yes, yes. yes well, yes, not yes. sea world. No, oh, no, 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 wait, fuck sea world. Fuck sea world. No, Do no, not no. Go. That's exploitation. Yeah, we don't yeah. do that. No, no, no. No. But, but just the world of the sea. The, the world of the sea, that's what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that sea world was an establishment. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, really? I love the ocean. It's my dream. I expected your For You page to be boys. <laughs> oh, my God. Ew. No, really. Yeah, I know. I mean, I think just because you chat about them. I do, but, like, ew. But, like, ew. Don't want them more. I don't want to look page. at that. Really? I just want ocean animals. Can't relate. Can't relate. You, to be fair, mine is, like... Mine is literally like cocker spaniels and then oh. like the odd sexy man with tattoos, which I quite like that. I like that contrast. Me too. I'm I like, like that. I get a bit hot and heavy seeing that. And, and then, then I'm it's like, oh, like, wholesomeness, sloppy ears. Yeah, cute. Probably something then, else. Uh -huh, sloppy ears, you know? Balance. Yeah, okay. balance. Balance. <laughs> mine, mine is like, yeah, humpback whales or nails. And it rhymes. Uh -oh. Is that a bar? Humpback whales and nails. Uh -oh. Write it down and put it in a song. Okay. Humpback, humpback whales and nails. Humpback whales and nails. <laughs> That's so good. Thank you. Okay. Cool. What I've always wanted to ask you... <gasps> I'm nervous. And I'm still what, sat like that. What weird, makes man. you... Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to move. I'm really I comfy don't think like you this. should be comfy. Okay. Um, what makes you write about men? What makes me write about men? Yeah. As in, like, write? No, no, no. Write, write. Like, songs. <laughs> oh, you're also right <laughs> about them. So, like... <laughs> yeah, I said it. Um, uh, just, I don't know my experiences that I have. When you were like, right, I'm going to be this bitch, I'm going to be an artist, I'm going to be a singer girly. Yeah. Were you always like, this is what I'm going to talk about? No. no. I, just, I don't really think, like, when I go to the studio, I don't go to the studio like, I want to be this, I want to make a song like this. Because right. Every time you go into a studio session, you talk shit for, like, an hour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. two hours, maybe three hours, maybe the whole Yeah. Day. And then you come to, like, a head of, like, oh, my God, that's jokes, and then you just write about it. Right. So when I write songs about boys <sighs> and... <laughs> boys and like situations i'm never like i want to do this and i want to be this girl and right like, right right you're just like i'm, I'm just, just like, gonna here's chat what about happened and here's how it is bitches and really yeah do you do you actively write about exes mm, i mean it would seem so <laughs> yeah yeah i because... don't i don't go out of my way to do that like i have no. so many songs that are like about other things i was yeah yeah yeah, yeah but like totally. the ones that people but the give ones a shit that about. burn in my brain are your boy ones yeah, that's what i'm saying and you have to just give the people what they want yeah you and do I also wanna, like, i think 
when I perform them as well and I see everyone just like, ah, I'm yeah. like, okay, that's what I do it for. Do you have a bigger female audience? Yes. Yeah. For sure. It, like when I first started doing music, it was like 90% female. Or maybe really? even more. But now it's like, because I think I've started getting the titties out more. Oh, honestly. Which, by the way, are looking unbelievable. Did you see that video where they're just flopping? As in, but when you're in that little tartan <laughs> thing, I watched it on the way here because I was like, let me see what she's up to so we have some like topics tits. of conversation. And I thought, tits. not me only looking at your tits. And I thought, well, I've not planned anything for the pod, but no, I've seen her but tits. The boobs. Like, since I've started wearing more, like. And that was enough. You know, I see my boys turn up. And Do it's you? Kind of, like, fucked up, you know, but also. Uh, it's, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I agree. Do you know what? It's the same energy as when. <laughs> I'll tell you what it's the same energy as. <laughs> Obviously, cat calling not okay. No, I get it. It's not okay. But, 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 but if I choose to put something on, and everyone's like, "Cool." I'm... Sometimes I'm not opposed to no. a bad man being like, "Oi!" Well... I'm like, <laughs> obviously, my my initial response is to be like, "Ugh, fucking pig." Mine is, <laughs> I'll walk away and go. Ew. Because I'm kind of like, oh, I did eat, though. Like, I did eat, and I did wear these fatty leggings for a reason, for and if reason. nobody said anything, I'd be pissed off. <laughs> so I was like, catcalling is bad. It is. But I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Okay. Do you see what I'm I putting in a song, Katie? Put catcalling fucking... is not bad. It's bad. It's bad, but, but I'm, I'm not, not mad. Or sad. <laughs> and I fucked your dad. Oh, oh. Obviously, she had to add that. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, it's the same energy but it's as that. True, like, and whenever I post a video or a picture of yeah. me in, in, in a bikini, it gets mm. like triple the likes and interactions. And I'm like, do you know what? I'm not sitting it's at the so top of so the No, like agreed. That. Who gives a fuck? Agreed. Does it piss you? Does that part of the industry piss you off a bit? I don't really care. Do you not? I don't care. I'm Good just for like, you. This is. It is what it is. Uh, yeah. I like, I've, You're almost like, let's just be realistic here. And like, I don't really, I don't think a lot about many things because I'm just like, if I do think about things too much, I won't do anything and I'll just be upset. If you... I'm over, just here for the lols. Yeah, and, and if you it. overthink everything, you will just end up like picking apart everything yes. you do and being like, oh shit, I shouldn't have done I'd, that. I'd live in a hole and yeah. I wouldn't do anything. Like, I, I wrote a song about Dilfs, like, oh my God, what's wrong with me? Good no, for you. Fuck it, who cares? Yeah. It is what it is. I did find that, what, so... <laughs> My my five second music career, eighty thousand years ago. I'm very old. Um, <laughs> was I remember just thinking, oh, it's annoying. Like, because it that is just the game. It is. As in, if you are a woman, you need to shake a little bit of ass and just a, a tiny bit, bit of titty. Tiny bit. You don't need to get them out, but also like you I do. kind of enjoy it because I'm. I Same. Wear, I most of the time I wear like baggy things. Yeah. And then occasionally I'll do like a an outfit, like a cute and everyone's little... like, "What? Where? When?" I and didn't I'm know like, that was hiding. Under I'm like them for jeans. ages, literally yeah. for ages. But I just suddenly feel the need to just. Ugh. Yeah, I get it. 2024, the titties. Do you know what I mean? 2024 is the year of the titties. That's what I'm saying. Write that. I'm telling you, I just almost want to sit and write a song with you because I feel like so many little nuggets of like gold coming into my head. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I Let's just used to find that me and you in the studio would be. We, hell. We'd get nothing done. No, no, there'd be nothing. We haven't gone out yet either. That's what I'm saying. But I live in London now, so. Arr. I don't know what that sound was. I'm sorry. That, we're definitely going out. Okay. Where is your favourite place to go out? In London? Yeah. I have no idea. <gasps> Like, I go out, obviously, but I don't know where I'm going. I really? Just, I just go. Do you just follow the, the like, London lot? Yeah, they go, we're going here now, and I'm like, sweet. And then I end up having a, a blast. Really? Oh, we're about to be on these streets. Let's go on the streets. Yay! Okay. Do you know what? Where was a fun night out? What? Brighton. <gasps> where did you go in Brighton? Shoot. Oh. Yeah, I know. Well, I tell you what, I tell you what, I must say, I must that was say. That you had a good night out in shoes. Yeah. I had the best to night be fair, out there, and was... I'll tell you why. <laughs> well, because, because I couldn't see. <laughs> so, so, in, in my head, I would have had a good night in a cardboard box. I did. It, I, I could have been at shoes, I could have been at home. <laughs> like... Shoot. Um, oh. It was rotten. It, the vibe was giving, like, Oceana yeah. or prison. But, like, sometimes that's fine. And I was like, I'm, I'm here, fine okay, with okay, it. Okay, okay, I was like, back. I'm fine with it. Like, a cringy night out sometimes is what you need. Oh, as in, if Kings of Leon start playing at the end of the night, I'm in hell, but also I'm on the so table. far gone that I'm like, 
Absolutely. Yeah. No, I get you. I take back what I said. Yeah. She, she was just fine for a funny night out. I had a funny night out, out in Shush, but it was during the day. But in the summertime, they, they have like these benches. They've closed it down now, though, I swear. Have they? I don't know. I might be lying, but I think they have because I've not seen them at Raiders. But My achy, like... breaky heart. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> All sad. those memories. <laughs> nah. But yeah, really? They have like an outside city bit with like fires and stuff, and I got fucked honestly during the day. Are you? See, day drinking. I think I'm over. No. Summertime day it, drinking. Hey. Summertime day drinking. But not just like for the jollies now. Not in Je February. <laughs> so we were just discussing that. Why is it scientifically proven that January is 30 seconds long? Yes. No, sorry, 30, 30 years long. Yeah. January is 30 years long, but February is one day. Is one day. Why? It's March in two weeks. How? Because I've, I've not done anything. No, but you have. Oh, I have. But I have, but I don't think I have, but we have. We have. I have, you have. <laughs> have. I've seen, we have. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get so it. So we need to, people comment and discuss that phenomenon because everybody feels collectively the same about it. Also, like, the older you get, the years just go by faster. Like, it's tough. Shut the fuck up, Katie, because you're so young. Don't make me, <laughs> don't make me pissed off. Remind me how old you are. I'm 21. <laughs> <laughs> what? 21. 18 anyway. And I just turned 28, as in wrap me in loincloths and call me Tutankhamun. I may as well just be done now. Shut up. I'm like turned to ashes and dust. 28 is hot. Do you know what? It is hot. Like, and also... It's <laughs> It is hot. And also, I feel like it's always going to be hot when you get older. I'm excited to get older. Do you know what? It. Weirdly, I am one of these people I do think I'm like... Peter Pan. Peter Pan. Like, I feel Peter Pan-esque to the point where I'm like, every year I get older, I have an existential breakdown. Mm. But I'm also like, but I am low-key giving fine wine. No, you are. <laughs> because I feel like I'm getting better each year. Period. Or at some point that will to. decline. No, 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 But no, right no. now, it's, it, I do feel like it's doing also, that. Also, the way the world's going, like... I'm going to look like this forever. Do you know what I mean? Hey, oh, one million percent. Do you know what I mean? As in Botox. Botox. Botox, baby. And the collagen. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> I've started drinking collagen now. Oh, I can't... I don't know how I feel about that. I had a thing in Really? LA. I had this, well, like... not that you need it. You're literally 12. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I had this collagen drink in LA because I was feeling fruity and it was vile. Oh, really? Yeah. See, I've just got powder... Powder. Yeah, guys, from Amazon, powder. And it's, yeah, I mean, yeah. This Does it is... work? This is what I think, like, if, if you think about things too much, like, I think about everything. Like, I when know. I spend eight pounds on a face wash, I'm like, does that work? You're like, but why? When it was, like, the olden days, they didn't have face wash. And a man will use a three-in-one shampoo for their ass, back and crack and face and look a million dollars. <laughs> and I've still got acne. <laughs> <laughs> Someone explain that. It's true though. It's so Is true. it not true? Head and, head and shoulders. And shoulders the one. <laughs> oh head and God. shoulders. I can't use head and shoulders because my granddad used to wear it. And I, I can't had... believe they're still in business. Neither. I, I'm almost certain it's made of petrol. It can't be. That's not real ingredients, is it? Head and shoulders. Head and shoulders. <laughs> what do you mean, bruv? What do you mean, bruv? What do you mean? Yeah. Like, the whole... Everything. Everything. No, and the face. Just what? Just one bottle. One bottle, that's wrong. And they all look good. Oh, I mean... I know what you mean. I always talk about this. My Insta sometimes makes me feel... All, just social media in general. Yeah. Makes me feel like I need to, like, be up to date with all of these. Like, to be fair, I'm not going to lie, I went to see a facial aesthetics guy recently. I basically, I just said to him, like, is there anything I can do to just, like, give me a bit of... And he was basically like, there's, I think, what you want to achieve. I, I was like, how can I have the draw of Angelina Jolie? He uh -huh. was like, a face transplant. I was like, cool, I'll leave then. Obviously, like, what can I do? I can't, like... Like, like the gua sha. It, Does yeah. that work? I see these TikToks on, oh, like, my morning routine, my gua sha. And I, I do do it every night Do now. you? I do now, yeah. My my videographer, she always does it. And yeah. And skin is perfect. Maybe, really? Maybe it does work. I'm just a... And then you're thinking, this. well, yeah. But he basically said to me, I went, well, what can I do, this, that and the other? And I went, to be fair... I'm actually pissed off that he said this to me. I had a whole mini breakdown. It was one of them weeks. I think I was on my period, so I was just... <gasps> 
Oh, that's the worst. In general, feeling rotten. Just, but not in, in a cute way. N not in a cute way. No, I hear you. And I basically sat down and said, what can I do to make myself feel better? And he basically went, oh, honestly, at this stage, I wouldn't do anything on you. And he gave me a nice, like, OK, great. I'm going to... I went... To be fair, yeah, I'm only 28. I had this real 360 in, in his office. And then he went to me, oh, no, don't get me wrong. When you get to 28 is the year where collagen just goes... <laughs> and I went... <laughs> oh, I just... I thought, why did he say that to me? Because then I went because and ordered... Because he wants some money. Yeah, That's and then I went why? and ordered a 50-pack of collagen from Amazon because I thought, shit. Oh, my God. I'm going to turn to dust otherwise. No. Yeah, I know. No, no, no. It's bad, isn't it? I don't think... You're beautiful. Thanks. You are. So are you. Thank you. Should we lips? Yeah. <laughs> 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 but I, like, I always get into these holes on TikTok about, like, ageing and, like, everything. Yeah. And what can I do to be the best? But then at the end of the day, all I do is just, like, eat pot but noodles you... and not enough water. Like... That was one of my New Year's resis. More water? Yeah. Well, here I am, just... Tell the Will I Am story. Oh, my God. So I went to... <laughs> I went to LA the other day. And I went to Will I Am studio and I asked for a bottle of water and it was literally like <laughs> the size of this. Because she was like, she came in and was like, oh, I'm so sorry, this, this water's really small. And I was like, actually, I've had a smaller. <laughs> and it was literally this big, but it was so cute. And I got but another why? one because I just wanted to hold it and take a picture of it. Was it that shape, though? No, no, it was like, you know, the like Highland Springs sort of vibe. Yes. But not, it was like LA Springs. What do you think of LA? I hate it. Thanks. Do you hate it too? It's a simulation. It's a simulation. It's a simulation. Simulation. Um, what's the Jim Carrey film? Oh my God, Truman Show. LA it, is the Truman Show. It is just like, I can't. I feel like... It's so loads of weird. people like it, but I feel like we share the same sort of personality as Yeah, life. we do. Where we want people to just be like, ah. a bit just like normal yes. and like chaotic and don't pretend to be... You know Honestly, what I mean? Honestly, but even like as a place, like it's just like shit. There's nothing. There's nothing to do. It's too big. It's a shit hole. It's, it's it's like terrifying and like dirty. I expected LA. Like I remember, all all you hear is like LA, LA. Like I'm we're, going to LA. We're all dreams of go to LA. I was so excited, especially as an artist, Ooh, right? I was buzzing. That's like oh LA. Where's my Grammy then? I'm in LA and I'm, I'm LA. doing it. Like, yeah, here I am. And I just thought, first of all, I got there. The place was smelly and rotten, and I thought, Terrifying. ooh. Yeah. Oh, that's not. That's not on. I was like, this isn't what I was that's expecting. not the LA I know. No, this is not the LA that I expected. <laughs> and everyone was like, no, no, Ash, this is how it is. And I went, oh, no. Oh, no. And the only bit that was actually peng was obviously the Beverly Hills bit, but that's where, like... The millionaires and trillionaires Beyonce live. lives. And yeah. I was like, well, yeah, of course, that's mm. nice. Do you know what I mean? It's mad, like, obviously, in London, there's, like, nice bits and bad bits. But, yes. like, the, like, the drastic change of nice bits and bad bits in LA is, like... Yes. Like, you drive up in the hills, and it's like, wow. And then you drive down to, like, the city, and it's, like... And it's absolute Oliver Twist, and I don't understand it. Is. It. it is terrifying. But also, let me just, you know, reverse it. There was one day where I thought I would never go to LA. So I'm grateful that I am. Agreed. LA. Agreed. But at the same time, it's a shitter. It is, yeah. <laughs> so let's not forget. <laughs> let's not Thank forget. Thank you, that. but I don't know. I just <laughs> thought, do you know what? I've got a perfect story actually to describe LA. Tell me. We were at this restaurant once. <laughs> We're at this restaurant, right? And we're having a few drinks, a few cocktails, whatever. This lady keeps coming over. She's a waitress, right? Mm -hmm. She's really nice. We're, like, chatting to her, whatever. I'm one of those people that I like to make staff think I'm the best person there. Yeah. You know, like... Go I, out of your way. Yeah, I go out Wait, of my way. So I will I slag off way. everyone at my table yeah. so that the member of staff yeah. loves me. I I'll be you. like, oh, God, I know. Like, Sorry you spoke to you like sorry. that. Like, <laughs> oh, darling, you, you look wonderful. You know, I'm, I'm just <laughs> that. Which you done? Yeah, literally that, is, that. That is me. That is me. That is me. Yeah. And I, she, she was really nice, really friendly. She was giving us our drinks, whatever. And then she went, I mean, as a director of beverages, I went... Hang on. Uh, director of beverages. <laughs> and I thought, <laughs> bruv, that that good for you, but like a director. You are you were the waitress. But that that there's no shade in being a waitress though. Like just say you're a waitress. She was like direct No no. She literally corrected me and said, I'm a director of beverages, bro. And I was like, and I was so joked by this point that I couldn't, you know, when you're like <laughs> Yeah, yes. I really wanted to laugh because I just thought, 
okay. And my mate next to me was like, so, so what does that entail? Like, what does the director of beverages entail? Do you direct the beverages? Yeah, she, she, li you... she literally said there are beverages that need directing and that's what I do. <laughs> I thought, so you deliver beverages to the table and that's LA. Is that not? Director, that yeah. is so LA. Because it's like... What do you do? I'm a director of beverages. Yeah. What? 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 You're a lich... You're a waitress. Stop That's it. fine. Just say that, though. I, I fuck with... Actually, I hated being a waitress. Not gonna lie. I've been a waitress I've been before a waitress. as well. And it, it was Awful. jokes, to be fair. I worked with my friends and it was sweet. Like, it could have been much worse. It was just yeah. fucking customers. What was the worst job you've ever had? I worked in a chip shop. Not you in the chippy. Me in the chippy at 13 years old. My mum said, Kate, you've got to go get a job. I said, yep. 13? Yep, 13. I worked in a chip shop. Mum doesn't give a rush. Mum did not give a fuck. 13? I had two jobs at 13. I did. I'm a hard-working girl. Oh, my God. A mindset. Wow. It's a mindset. You, it is a mindset. 13, bro. Uh huh? I was going for you cinema every day at 13. I know. I, I, was, I was grafting. At the chippy? At the chippy. Did you come home smelling like the fryer every... I get, that's why I can't have vinegar anymore. I used to love vinegar, but then I used to come home with it, like, coming out of my pores. Emotional damage. No, for real. No. The only dub was that um, at the end of the night, you could just take back all the food that didn't get used. So, like, I would just have chippy. That's why Mumsy made you go to uh -huh. work. <laughs> just a what single mom who works two jobs. <laughs> <laughs> She said, I oh, see we ate the bar food. Working. Yeah. You go out, you bring back. You dinner. go out and bring chippy chippy leftovers yeah, I, every I'm day. Here for it. That's smart. That's really smart. It's smart. And it was only down the road. Didn't have to even drive me. I walked. I can't believe you worked at a chippy. I did. That was the worst one. When it did you go weird. full full time with music then? When I was 18? Fucking hell. Oh my god. And then I worked in a pub from 14. Till I was 18. I bet they loved you at the pub. They loved me. Yeah, that, that a bit is... too much. Yeah. Creepy, creepy, creepy pub pub people. Oh, what, like the locals Ugh. that come in at I had, I had this 2 p.m. for a shandy? And then don't leave. No. The whole day. No. I had this one guy that would come in every Thursday on a quiz night and he'd go... <gasps> You should be a model, Katie. Oh, God. Every single time, like, you should be. Are you a model? You really should be a model. <laughs> Every time he'd come over, order his Classic. Thing, Are you a model? No. No. Simon. Oh, God. I'm not. But thank no. you, though. Yeah, in it. Also, he, also, he's not wrong. He's oh. really not wrong. Yeah, he's not wrong, but also, also, yeah. Like, he's been on the Guinnesses since yeah. 2 p.m., so I don't know how. <laughs> But there was a few really lovely ones, to be fair, like these two old ladies that were just so sweet to me every Sunday for their roast dinner. Oh, Little I rose spritzer, that. and I just go, ugh. Me and my best friend in eight Do you know what? I think it's really vital that you have those jobs. It's character building. You have to do like, the shit jobs. the shit that I went through. Yeah. Like, no one deeps that. Like, I see the TikToks of, like, you know, you can't hurt me. I worked in hospitality. I'm like, that is it's true. It's true. Yeah. The pain. Yeah. So many days where I would have to hold back my tears and be like, do you want chips with that? What do you it want? Mashed potato. That. What do you want? <laughs> and don't tell me again. Do you want chips or mashed potato? And they say potato puree and you go... <laughs> and, and all you want to do is shit it's yourself. swill them all and yeah. just go, fuck off. Yeah, yeah. God. You have to. You actually do develop just a thin layer of iron steel you do. around you if you work in hospitality. You do, it's true. It's horrendous. The, the people that would just come up to you and think that they, like... That's why, like, when I go to, like, restaurants now, I I'm always nice to people like Same. that anyway, because I'm not a f Sorry. I think, no, good for you. But I like, love the C word. I, I want to say that can, more can, in 2024, can, can, can. actually. <laughs> like, you know, when you go out for dinner and people are rude to the waitresses, I'm like, that is so... Or, like, rude to their parents. Like, but shut up. Biggest like, red flag ever. But, like, I can't, because I've, I've been rooted on by, yeah. by a customer, and it honestly makes me just want to... And it's Ugh. horrible, and you because... Can't do anything. Also, don't shoot the messenger, bro. It's not Isn't my it? fault that they've run out of beef roast. I don't... I'm, I, I don't know what to say to you. I don't you. supply it. No, I don't... I'm, I'm 16. I don't kill the cow. I don't I'm kill trying the cow. to make a quick buck. I'm trying to so make I a living. So I can go out of the weekend. I'm trying to go... Yeah. That's it. <laughs> it's, it's, so true. it's fucking annoying. I know. I hate people. I always think if there's... I think the biggest marker of whether a guy's a dickhead or not is how I actually need you to actively be wonderful to staff. Of course. If you're not, if there's even an air of... Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I once had that. Ooh, that. Oh! 
car. And it was a group of like... Oh, it's big Tory business energy. Businessmen, group of businessmen at Christmas time ordered like set roast dinners. It was fucking heaving. Oh. I was the only person working in the restaurant and I worked hard. I was sweating. No. My makeup was everywhere. Apron all in disarray, uh -huh. like, running about. Shit all over me. And I drop, I, I put like his food down and I walk away and he goes, um... <laughs> he goes... And my mum and my dad... With were, that as well, that <laughs> makes it worse. My mum and my dad were having a meal, like, by the window next to the table. My dad looks at me, and my dad's the only person that can chill me when I'm about to fucking... Really? <sighs> so I look at him, and I went... And he went... Oh. And I went... <laughs> yeah? Uh. Not gonna get you, sir. He went, I asked for beef. This is lamb. I was like, you are a fucking lamb. Oh, Shut awful. you out. Anybody you who clicks. Click. In it? And a point. And a point. Clicking a point. Clicking a point. Clicking a point. Clicking a point. I would have booted him out there and then, that's I know. it. Ugh. How have we done this? No! We knew How we'd do we done We this? knew we'd do that. Okay. <laughs> so <laughs> we're fucking jokes. I knew this would happen. This is what I'm saying. Oh, this, this hair is a fucking serve, by the way. Do you think? I love it. I, it's a little bit windswept and interesting today because no, I I'm just washed it. it I really like it. I like the, yeah. the um, what's it called? My little, my, little, my little money piece. It's stunning. I have a money piece, but it's, you can't see it because I need to get my roots um, done. Did you do this zigzag formation? No, my hair person did it, but I, I normally do a zigzag. But it's on the back as well. Look. That's really... Uh, do you know, I wish I could do fun things with my it's hair. It's so easy. Just get a comb and go... J and just... J j j j j yeah, pull it up and then half it. I'll help you. You say this, right? No, no, no. It's I all... hate watching hair girlies online. They're like... Five fun hair ideas for summer. That will take you two hours to yeah. know what you're doing. And they're like this. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, bro, I, I can't see, to me, what the back of my hair looks like is, not a, my problem. is a you issue. It's not my business. I can't see it. No. If you're offended, walk away. Walk away. Mm. Okay, <laughs> let's speak about... I'm oh, fucking hell. Okay. We are, honestly, we could talk for years. This I is know. why me and her need to have a night out with me. <laughs> yeah, it'd be hilarious. Um, <laughs> Let's talk about your new single. Uh, it's called I'm a Problem. I'm a Problem. I'm a Problem. Um, what inspired it? What inspired shit it? Shit men, obviously. No, just shit <laughs> people. Like, really? Yeah, I was in LA the like, first time I went. And, like, all these people that, like, aren't really my friends, but are my friends, but aren't my friends. Right. Oh, they yeah, were just, like, classic. bitching about me and just being, like, she's so loud. Like, what are you even doing with your music? Like, I don't get it. Like, it's just ugh, all, all of this shit. And I was, like... Do you want to be uh, he, Yeah. Like, why, why are you talking about me so much? Keep my name out, out your, your fucking mouth. mouth. Like, don't, like, if you don't give a fuck, why am I the main topic of your conversation? Why am I... Let's think about why that. Why am I the lead subject in the girls' group chat? I agree. Like, shut up. Was it girlies as well? Girlies. Uh, girlies and boys. But, like, I only get pissed off by the girly ones because I'm yeah, like... Yeah, because boys on. are whatever. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Who cares? Like. Yeah, but it was just... The fun. girly ones hit deep, I think. Yeah, and then it was also, like, I was getting loads of hate, my, like, my first lot of hate on social media. Just, just really? Because, like, I don't know what I was doing, but people were just hating on me, and I was like, this is... Horrible. Out of what? I think... Do you know what it is as well? I think yours, your music is so confident, mm. and the way that you are in your music is confident, yeah. like, in your videos and everything... To me, it's like the best thing ever. Yeah. And I think to anyone that is confident and loves that energy, but I think if you've got an inch of insecurity on you, the first thing that they say is, oh, too much. Too much. You're too, too loud. Much. Too much. Yeah. And I'm like, you're, you're too little. Yeah. You don't give enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank That's you. why I don't know who you are. <laughs> Much to think about. Do you know what I mean? I always think I'd rather be <laughs> too much than too little. Oh my god, yes! I'd rather be the person that was like, oh my god, do you remember that girl? She was so yeah. fucking. Like, if you're ridiculous. too little, do you remember? No, oh, no one. Who was that? <laughs> no one. Who, Who was that? Yeah. Who? Who's Katie? What? Fart no. in the wind. Yeah, could never be you. No, no, that, that could never, never be, be you me. either. No way. No, no, no. No way. But that's what I mean. And then, like, when I was talking about the song, the producer was like, that's a problem, you know? Like, people are going to get annoyed that you're encouraging all so these people. So you were like, like, and that's where. I was like, oh my god. Let's, like, create a fucking community of just, I'm like, a problem. I love that. And I love it. It's going great. All the men are in the comments going, well, this is real. Oh, my God, are they? Yeah, I had one guy DM me that was like, I'm really disappointed in you, Katie. I love your music. But the first line, I've got big dick energy, as if it means that, like, size matters. Imagine all the boys that don't have this. Like, imagine how you're belittling them. Oh, one, for it's a metaphor. I'm not talking about the dick size. <laughs> yeah, I'm no. talking about the energy. The energy. That's and if what... it's small, just say, like, yeah. God. Uh, as See, you can have a tiny cock and have big dick energy. Exactly. <laughs> I haven't even got a cock and I've got big dick energy. Who cares? It's a fucking song. And I've got a tiny one and I've got... <laughs> <laughs> but I've, I've 
<laughs> I've known multiple men oh. with very, very big dick energies. Uh -huh. Tiny peckers, and it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't tiny pecker. But, yeah, it's it a tiny pecker. Pecker. <laughs> I either call it a pecker or a um, cocktail sausage. That's amazing. <laughs> Unless it's like uh, something wham. The other day it. I called it a todger. I love todger. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> todger. Todger's very like um, what your mum and dad would yeah. call it back in the day. Yeah, yeah. Your todger. Yeah, your todger. Your todger. So, okay, I love that. Thank so you. So you're excited about this thing. Have you performed it live yet? Uh -huh. I've been performing it for ages. I did it Have in you? Australia. But, like, I, nobody knows about it. And then the Have you been reaction... posted that you've been performing it live? Um, I don't think so. Not yet. No, because I swear I haven't seen you. But it's coming. Okay. And I'm, I'm, I'm performing tomorrow. I'm going to um, the Gadio Awards. Gadio Stop. Prize. Stop. Where well, oh, are the gays, gays and slays? I was going to say, oh. the gays must go mad for it. And my outfit is so Is it's it? So what is it? It's, like, like fur crop jacket, like, Ariana Grande looking two-piece, and these, like, boots that come all the way up to here. Oh, slay. White lashes, extensions. Slay bells. Um, I feel like we might have to put a little link to the song. Yes. <laughs> la la. Link below. I don't even know if that's where it's going to be. Link below. Click the link. I want to quickly play a game with you. Okay. You've got a song called Would You? Uh, oh, I have. <laughs> Not you forgetting like, that you had a song called Would You? I was like, what? Yeah. yeah I do, sorry. Uh huh, yes, you will. Once you want the red or blue pill. Thank you. So I recorded that song and I was absolutely steaming and I wrote it in like 10 minutes. Did you? I was on a night out and they called me saying, Kate, you've got to go to the studio and get on the song. And I was like, okay. You know, why do I think, is that not like the most, the most listened? It was, uh, I don't, I don't look. I'd rather just not. I'm going to look. Me. But I was honestly. They were trying to like, tell me, Kitty and I was like, no, Bixer. I've got it, I've got it, press record. And I was, uh-huh, yes, you will. What do you want the man Baby yeah. girl. Tell me. Four mil. Four mil. <laughs> and I she wrote it steaming, so if that doesn't tell you... Wrote and recorded it in about 30 minutes, steaming, because I wanted to go back out. <laughs> Good for you. If that doesn't tell you that you could achieve anything if you put your mind to it. I was in the Uber, like, listening to it, right, okay, okay, okay. Uh, uh, I got it. And I was like, no. oh, I've got it. I've got it. Everyone pass record. Yeah, but I, I also like that because just your inhibitions are away with you. It is. And it was fun. I had a great Which time. Which makes sense because it's fucking slapped, apparently. Thank you. According to Spotify. Okay, we're going to play a game called Would You? Okay. I'm going to do quick fire questions to you. Okay. And you tell me your answers. Okay. Would you date a guy that's under six foot? Yeah, I have before. Five eleven. <laughs> Smaller than me. Five eleven. You've dated for so you're what five I'm nine? I'm oh. a five seven babe. I love a short king. Really? Call me crazy. I love that for you. Like everyone's like tall man, tall man. I'm like yeah, sure, but I don't care. You it's, don't care. I don't care. As long as you're just not an asshole. Oh, but he was so. Ah. Actually, no, he wasn't. Damn. I'm being mean. He was sweet. I'm, 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 really? Mm -mm. No. I'm not going <laughs> to lie. Um, you can't be short and an arsehole. It's true. <laughs> do, do you see what I mean? Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, well, exhibit A, I am short and an arsehole. So there you go. <laughs> Would you offer to pay on a first date? Yeah. I Good don't girl. Care. Good girl. Yeah, I don't care. I do the same thing, but low-key, it's a test. <laughs> Loki, I haven't got my wallet on. No, no, Loki, as in, I will always, first date specifically, I'll always offer. Yeah. Always. And if you say yeah, cool. Cool. Noted. Noted. <laughs> I got it. Noted. I'm no, like, a bit of a pagan, but it's okay. <laughs> Would you date a girl? I don't think so. Really? I could snog a girl. Yeah. And really get into well, it. Well, we snog occasionally. Yeah, like, that's what we're going to do. That's why we have to leave. Yes. But, like, I could definitely snog a girl and really enjoy it. But I don't think I could have, like, date a girl. Because I love, I love, a, I love a good boy. Just love a boy. I do, and I love the whole... Oh, oh. Love a man. I do. Yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs> Would you date an OnlyFans, bro? Um, is it full dick? Full dick and balls and ass out on the internet. Yeah. And sex. With other Not people. sex. Just dick, balls and ass. It's dick, balls and, and ass. And face? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, why not? Go sex work! <laughs> <laughs> Date a footballer. Yeah, if you're not a then fine. I don't care. I just love you. <laughs> and I think we should go out forever. Oh my God, yes! Would you fart? In front of someone you're newly seeing. Yeah. Have done. 
Yeah. Will do. And, and will continue yeah, to do. Yeah, I'm like, it's just, what is it? I try to not. Although, do you know when you're holding a fart for so long when you're with someone and you come home and your stomach is hurting and then you get home and you just... I'll tell you, my biggest <laughs> issue is I fart in my sleep. Same. And it wakes me up. <laughs> so there's been multiple times where I've been having a fun sleepover. A fun sleepover. And I swear to God, you know, it's all, you know, romantic, cuddling, whatever, and, I, and it's just gone... <laughs> Oh, no. And what I'll do is I'll pretend to be asleep. Like, even if it's woke me up, I'll be shocked and I'll go... <laughs> because I'm like... That's iconic. I can't let on that I'm aware of no, this. No, 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 it wasn't you. No, that, that wasn't, wasn't me. That was not me. me. You must have a cat. You must have a cat or a <laughs> farting ghost. That's yes. Know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Would you date a guy with a girl best friend? Yeah, I don't care. Good. I don't care. Yeah. If you don't give me a reason to believe that you're cheating on me or being a, a dickhead, then I don't care what you do. I completely I agree. I could not talk to my, my boyfriend or my whoever mm. for, like, a whole day. Or even, like, if you're hey, going out, and I'd be like, cool, bye. Have yeah. a good time, love you. Me too. I don't get it when girls are like, ooh, can't go out. You're like, my, my guy's not on the streets once he's with me. What? But I'm on, I'm the, on streets. the streets. <laughs> yeah. I'm there wearing next to nothing, shaking my ass, but nobody's touching. Like, yeah, nobody's touching. Exactly. It doesn't matter. It goes the same way. Like, yeah. I'm, I'm not into all of that sort of stuff. I agree. I just think, be, be cool. Be chill. Would you ever do a reality TV show? What one? I feel like you just wouldn't now. Because why? Like, I wouldn't. Would you do like an I'm a celeb? Mm. You'd be jokes on that. Like to be I fair. wouldn't, I wouldn't want to. I don't ever want to like. <laughs> what be... if the back was good enough? <laughs> <laughs> like I don't ever want to be like. Oh, you know, I've got to do this now to just to you know keep it going. I don't want to be it's like that. Is that in it? But like if if it, it, if it, was it like... feels a little bit, I'm trying to stay relevant. Yes, but if it was like I'm still like doing my shit and they were like yeah. do it, I'd be like yeah. Yeah. Funny. And it would be like a good challenge, right? I've always thought, because of my toxic trait is I watch the shows like that. I think that I can do it. I'm like, you're all massive. It was a thought of a spider, so I just thought of it. Makes I can't work. believe you didn't see them when you were in, down under. Not one, not one single thing. That's what's interesting. Would you, oh, would you have a public relationship? No. Really? Nope. It's bad for branding though, isn't it? <laughs> I agree. Also, like, I just don't... Pe I don't care. Like, you don't need to know what I'm I doing. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Would you? No. I wouldn't. I don't feel the need to... Like. I also... I'm, I'm, a, I'm just so, so cynical that I could be madly in love and I'll still be like... Yeah, but it's going to end at some point and I see BA for a public breakup, so no. you're not making like, it anywhere. Like, I'm sorry, just letting you guys know we've broken up. Yeah, oh. that... Like, I'm in a relationship Public announcement, with you, like, yeah. Like a million people. Who cares? I, yeah, I don't care. Okay. I would not do that. We're calling a truce on that. Yeah. And that's it. A slay. Oh, I love you so I much. I love you so much. It's no. real. I love you um, so much. Let's and, go out and be silly. And this is us pinking to Short Kings and Silliness Short on a Kings Night Out. Short Kings and Silliness on a Night Out. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> live, live and direct from me and Gru. Uh-huh. Like, comment, subscribe if you're watching. Leave me five stars if you're listening. Tell your nan, tell your granddad. Write a song about me. Write a book about me. And go stream her new fucking single, all yeah. right? Mwah, love you.